But welcome back to Evo Land, and uh, we're going to jump in right here to our save where we finished off last night. And tonight we're going to just literally see if we can't do uh, or get to 100% is the goal for today. Now, there's quite a few bits, bits and pieces that uh, we can potentially do here. And um, I think for a start, we will let's fly around for a moment or two and just see whether or not there is actually like anywhere we have missed. So we went in that cave there. All this like secret, secret stuff over here, and I don't know if they're, like there is a way to get to it. If we just sort of like fly around for a bit, maybe we'll be able to find a way. It's an interesting town. Is this where we started? Quite possibly. Obviously we can't fly over the mountains, which is a real shame. Say, can I not like land the airship? Thank you. Mika, what's going on? Hope you're well. Welcome, welcome. So this is the Crystal Caves. I don't think here actually we have the ability to use bombs, so we might not want to be in here too much, but we're going to need to do some grinding, I think, to, um, uh, to be able to get some more glees so that we can buy everything at the shops and stuff. Do you find me, Kai? Uh, how's your day been? I hope it's been uh, real good. Life's increased. We're now level seven. Yeah, so I don't think we're gonna want to. This was just where the um, the evil dude was for a start, right? So I wonder if there is anything. Uh, it was Kefka's ghost, wasn't it, that we fought in here? I do wonder if there's like anything else to. Uh, find in here if we like go back to like the boss room my health increased literally by about three hit points our music is epic though I could listen to that all day uh... Uh, yikes. Yo, Fumbly, what's going on? Hope you're well. Uh, we did a yikes. Mistakes have been made. All right, we're going to have to quit the game. Uh, I got, what's going on with my controller? It's like still not working. Steam! I blame you. Let's try this again. Hopefully minus the controller issues. So, those of you who just joined, welcome, welcome. We are um, just basically questing out here for try and get 100%. The end of the day for me, so it works. I haven't just woken up. <laughs> Is that a sarcastic? You haven't just woken up, or have you genuinely not just woken up? That's right, isn't it? I see the name of that enemy, the Cobra Zero, and I instantly think like Coke Zero for some reason. Don't know why. Saved. You are safe for now.
Alright, so there is nothing else to do in here. That's fine, we got a bit of, um, did a bit of experience levels. Got a few experience levels, sorry, I should say. Major curious. It's fine. I didn't know if that was like your like sarcastic way of saying like totally haven't been in bed all day. Totally haven't just kind of got up sort of thing. No shame on me. I should 100% this first time through, right, Mika? <laughs> Total shame on me. How dare I play this game again? So the village there... a little bit. It's done it again! What? What? What is going on with the controller? The whole game's just like locking up. Huh. It's like that glitch on the uh, House of Da Vinci all over again, Mika. <laughs> yeah, I know you're UK. I know. All right, well, I don't know what keeps happening here. We'll get some more glees. Maybe if you, like, go... I don't know, because it happened in this dungeon, didn't it? I was going to say, maybe if you, like, fly out of bounds too much with the airship, it um, crashes the game, maybe? We'll try and be a bit more careful with uh... Yeah, no, the game, I think the game said we was only at like 84%, I think, when we finished it last night, so... It's just like finding some hidden stars, finding some cards and bits and pieces like that, so... Uh, I don't think there's too much more to do. If we can 84% the game in like two hours, then... Pretty sure there's not going to be too much more to do. But alas, I may be wrong. This area looks a bit sus. The mines. Right, okay, now... So that crazy. I'm stopping by and saying hi. Uh, that's where the boss was, right? I think. See, I'm like really, I'm completely confused here because I'm pretty sure we came in from here like a completely different angle, and we left at like a completely different place as well. So, that's oh, just, just that, look. How oh, does Fawn get the chest? Is there a secret passage somewhere? That we can like bomb. Is 
So normally in this sort of thing, you'll see like a crack on a wall or something where you can place bombs. <laughs> Gotta chop down some more bushes, Mika. I failed because I did not chop enough bushes. I failed because I walked in the... What? what? How, did I... How come I ended up here? Where's the logic in that? What? What? I'm confused. What? What is even going on right now? I'm like zooming around like nobody's business right now. Wow. I are bad. Yeah, no, <laughs> I know. I have no idea what's going on. Alright, the goons are back. As are the typhoons. And we're dead. Oh, Mika, every time, man, I, I want to become famous. Every time. They're, right, they're just about to tell me, and then he's like, ban or something. Damn it! <laughs> this looks suspicious. Yo, Atom! How are we doing, buddy? Welcome, welcome. I will hydrate just for you. I just done it again. I'm starting to think like this game has issues with controller support. I just... All right. Thanks for making me resave my game. That, I appreciate it. Oh, I'll get the star again. I honestly don't know... Um, Fumbly, to be fair, because when I started the game, it just literally says press A to continue, even without a controller plugged in. So, um, to me, it kind of feels like it's controller only. Damn it. I'm going to die again in a minute. Hey, it was an accident. I broke 20 pots. Whoops. Whoops. Just thought I'm dead. <laughs> Cartoon Fallen Sand is classic. Yeah. Does it count that I got the chest then? Is it sent me back over here? Yeah, I got the chest. Okay, excellent. Well, at least I'm back to full health. You might want to check your death count, Atom. You know, I'm I'm not one to judge, but it doesn't quite seem right to me. Seventeen or thirty stars. How do we get that one? Is 
that is a question. There'll be a secret path somewhere that I am yet to unlock. And these five dudes are like the worst. Yeah, that was just that. There's a chest over there that I haven't got as well. Okay. It's all cool. Alright, 12 to go. Let's go there, you drop down. Alright, so there's a chest there. But how do I... Oh, I dropped the chest. You jerk. Find our way through the maze. trouble again there. It's almost like I like my maybe my game's just losing focus or something. For some bizarre reason. I just did like a an alt and tab there and it um, sorted it right out, so Twitch.tv I'm pretty sure though that the touchpad on the PS4 controller acts like a mouse sometimes so if I'm like touching it maybe uh, no, it's not actually. Who knows? Very strange. Why are there secret hidden chests? You douche. Gotta go down the pit. Oh yeah, because I'm I'm gonna get that on again. That's fair. It's real fair. guys because they are the worst. Right, arrows can't hurt them.
Yeah, this was a lights out puzzle. I remember this room. We're back to here. Yeah, they are pretty annoying. Can't remember why we came over here for before. What even was in this room? How can I open this? into there there's a button in there there's just like secret areas and I don't know how to get into them because there's no like cracks on walls or anything that would indicate that I need to like use a bomb to get through Unless there's like a weird way you can get on top of the blocks, maybe. Maybe I don't have all the abilities I need. Can't push the statues. Can't drop a bomb in the water. Probably like one really tiny thing that I've missed that will just allow me to do something. All right, well, we'll uh, we'll come back to this. We'll see if we can like find some like missing abilities or something. No, I, I tried Mika and it doesn't let me um, push them. would be gratefully appreciated here. I'm sure I've been here. No, there's no way to pull. You can only push in this game.
Uh, I think I remember being in here and doing all of this. I actually think this is like the starting area, isn't it? Where we... Where the game started. Seems kind of familiar. I thought there were some rocks and things that we could... Uh, that were like available to like blow up. There is in one of these foresty areas. But yeah, we're not going any further this way. memory. It's a very tough cactus. Not even Minecraft cactus is that tough. Reserved for agile adventurers. What do you mean by agile adventurers, I wonder? That's a lot of bad guys. That's a lot, a lot of bad guys. Got all these like weird little paths, but there's like nothing at the end of them. Such a tease. Yeah, it's. Um, I think it's it's done. It's done on purpose, to be fair, to simulate how bad these games used to be. But when I do agree that when you're in an area like this for an extended period of time, it does start to become a teeny tiny bit off putting. See, so there's a rock I need to break. It's quite clearly a breakable rock. Why well, I needed to break the rock though. Not sure. As it leads to nowhere. Like this path. No way through there. Did I look at that properly? I'm not sure. Mm, yeah, I did. Oh, 
Oh, well, I don't think there is anything else to be done over here at the moment. So I'm not sure what it means about that pass reserved for Agile Adventurers, though. town. I think it is. But I've not got my airship. I need to go back to the airship at some point. Uh, right, shops. Shop, 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 shop. We got the Emok. Really need to buy a Phoenix down there, do we? But it's fine. And did the weapon shop have anything else? This wasn't a weapon shop. It's locked. Can I not put a bomb in front of the door? Guess not. Well, what can I say? I'm just a vandal at heart. I can't believe I've like gone all that way and I've not um, had a random battle. A Zumba. Not a Goomba, it's a Zumba. Alright, so now I've got to get my way out of here again get my airship back. Anyone remember the way home? I missed a rock? Where? Good spot, Fumbly. Thank you very much. We got Red Wizard. Skeleton. Oh, 
half the cards. They can buy, a, there is one card to buy in the other village. where we started, wasn't it? Maybe. Yeah, that's where we started. I remember coming in here when we first um, came back to this area a moment ago, so... Oh, is it homemade bread maker? More of your sourdough. Killed the sourdough. Rest in peace, Inca's sourdough starter. You were tasty while you lasted. Are you, going to, uh, are you going to try and make another one, Mika, or...? Oh, there's another way through here, then, if there's bushes there to be hacked down. This area. I'm in a mini map. Everywhere looked like the same constantly. Okay. tent. I'm one of the last travelling merchants, son of the legendary Dorni Donico. I'm currently starving, haven't eaten anything for days. If you bring me some good meat, I'll give you something nice in return. Right, where do I get the meat from then? Cave here. Oh, the shrine of Babumat. This is new. Now, I think I was meant to do this earlier. Because I already have Babumat to use. I assume that achievement is because I've probably been to all the uh, places now. No clip through the bushes? Yeah, I never thought about that. 
Rookie mistake. about Mika? I don't know if you heard my question. I said, um, are you going to make another starter or... Uh... Not these dudes. These dudes are jerks. Where did they even send me? Oh, jeez. those tornadoes. Oh my goodness. What am I doing? This button's still pressed. I hope it is. Yep. Yeah, okay. Shut up, we can't go this way. For now. Alright, we made it free. Oh, you jerk. Give me some hearts. Nothing. Thank you. You listened. I appreciate. Alright, so what did that unlock? These fire dudes, like seriously, they are the worst. So we can't do anything with that. We've just been around here and we press the button. Not sure what it activates. Which isn't particularly helpful. Wasn't anything else over here, was there? Is literally just the button. There's another button there. Right, we have opened a gate. Let's 
just take the easy way back. No, it wasn't this way. I think it was up. Then right. Confidence. Oh my goodness. Don't think they put enough bats in this area. What? I don't know, I had that attack. Oh, and of course, you're going to throw some red guys at me. All my heart's going to end up in the water where I can't get them. This, this is fair. Totally fair. fair. Dropping a bomb here. What's in the chest? You got Superstar of Evil Land. You found 20 hidden stars. 20 out of 30. 10 to go. Alright, so I think this is the... This must be like the lights out... Or not the lights out puzzle, but activate all the lights puzzle. We have seen one of these previously. Yeah. I mean, I, I don't know, but I'm sure it's not too difficult, Mika. I'm sure you'll work it out. Oh my goodness, not these guys. Oh, how many? How many? Skeleton, do you want to die? Thank you. Should be all the red guys. So now I can snipe the skellies. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Evo land cognitive breakdown tests. You got the Babamat card. I mean, to be fair, it was donated by Conclan, so you know. done Go around here once more just to be sure I think there's a red guy isn't there around here no I must have got rid of the red guy Okay, well, we might be done then. Um, maybe the Shrine of Babamat was literally just to get his player, his card.
I don't think there's any more paths to explore. So I think we might be done here. Ten stars and ten cards to get. more to explore is there no secrets oh my goodness what the hell is that it's in a two in whatever one of those is Hidden meadow. The hidden cave. Interesting. Invasion of Undead Cats by East Crow Schrodinger on an Amazon bestseller. Hmm. As these of these hidden caves got for us, I wonder. I have enemies that can't attack me. Right, I guess it's just a star. I guess that is literally it. Slime card. Is that it? That looks like it's it. I wonder if there's any other, like, forest hidden areas. Oh, it's a it's a Tropico. I'm 
die. Let's go, Babumat! Use Mega Flare! You got that. That was indeed a big chicken. We got Cho. Okay, so we got the meat. Now, where was that guy in the tent? Anybody remember where we saw the guy in the tent? It was in a forest area somewhere, wasn't it? Here he is. I prefer it cooked. So how am I going to cook it? Talk about picky. But we're in this town, I wonder. So somebody here knows how to prepare it. Okay. But who? Maybe it's this woman. Hope you can defeat this Zephyros. Save our land and the whole world. Love Double Twin, not just playing the game, but also finding the cards. Most of them are, hidden, are quite easy to find, but the most powerful ones are well hidden. I'd love to see a complete collection one day. Oh, we don't have enough for that card. See if this woman up here, the nurse, knows how to cook this meat. You must go. Yeah, sure, heal me. You must go to the mana tree. So the monster is still alive. We're all doomed. Yes, please. Have a nice meal. All right, so now let's take it back to the guy in the tent. Like we said last night, this is like, this is like classic, like, sorry, I was too many likes in that sentence. This is classic RPG sort of stuff here. On a quest, you need to do this, but you need to do this first. Or this person needs this, but you have to go here, 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 and here first before you can drop it off, sort of thing. Always like fetch questing on an RPG. Yeah, probably. Yum! Cooked Chobaco meat. That's my favorite. Would you give it to me? Thank you very much. I feel alive again. Here's something nice for you. A bonus heart. Any extra support when fighting Zephyros? Well, we defeated with three hearts, so it's fine.
Bless me. Such a stuffy nose. One minute. Alright, so we need 10,000 glees before we can get that card off that woman, so maybe we'll just stay in this area and do some, and just grind a little bit. Then I was getting like loads of um, I was getting loads of money before. I don't seem to be getting a lot anymore. Need like another fourteen hundred. to the mines or the caves where there's more than one enemy maybe I'll get a bit more money and experience oh here we go this guy I'm sure he'll give me uh, uh yeah right so let's take up the zoombas first Angry teeth. Yo, he was pretty much free. There go, four hundred degrees. What's the sort of fire one? like grind in this area maybe we'll get a few more of those where you are sort of like walking around I think that the, literally the battles are completely not really random but the more enemies you get the more money you get so I did my health go back up to 101 yeah we just want like the multi the multi-enemy battles and then we'll be there in no time. I know where the big money is actually. I remember where the big money is. It was in that area that I said was the more like um, uh, Minecraft dungeons, wasn't it? That is here, I think. 
There's loads of money in this area. title now. Yeah. An Enderman farming area. And over what we need. Where's the crystal going? Went. Um. She's dead at the minute. I mean, she she died when we um, went to the tower to fight um, Zephyros the first time. So yeah, she's dead. But she lives on in us. In she lives on in us. So we still have her abilities, just as this single character. Definitely a lot stronger than uh, Click was, anyway. The crystal spell was a lot better than his sort of like physical attack, so. Don't worry about it, Mika, it's cool. Got plenty of money now. Let's head back to the town. Okay. 
So now we can go and uh, buy that really expensive rare card. The Undead King. We found 15 double twin cards. I'm going to save and then um, I think we'll maybe do a few card battles, see if we can win the championship thing, the jig. Star hidden in Forbidden Lake, okay. Card in not remind. I think he tells like what we're missing. Northwest Forest. We've already been to him, I think. All right, let's spend a few seconds, guys. Two seconds. Okay. So let's go and um, see if we can't uh, win some card games against this guy. Media. There's a good feeling about this. So, what's that? Take his car and have fives left there. Let's not use that card straight away. Alright, what you can do? <laughs> Alright, we'll play... This is a good all-round card. All right, beat my six. There you. He can't get more than me now. Woohoo! We win the medium battle. Hard. Oh, that was a good card. Um... have to take something at every turn to be able to win. What is that? Jerk. Even better than that, it's got to play this bottom corner here. What? You take two? When did the rules change? I smell a rat. I lost. I can't win. Sigh. Wow. We got annihilated. I actually can't take him on anything.
take the top. That would secure that one. Be me relatively safe. Now I can do that one. He's going to have something better than a three there, isn't he? So it's going to end up a tie game. It was a tie. Ooh, I'll we'll save that card. We'll get caught in a pinch. Uh, Alright, so start with this in the top corner. Take two cards. Yeah, you don't get to pick the... So yeah, it's just pure look as to like what cards you get, Mika. Obviously, the idea is that you play your card and then you have a higher score. You, the, the number has to be higher, basically. He's going to beat me on the last turn, yeah. In the uh, Final Fantasy VIII version of what this, that game is based on. Um, oh, I get to go first. Interesting. Yeah, in the Final Fantasy VIII version, um, you actually lose or gain cards from the other player when you win or lose the battle. So... Which is unfortunate. Ah, I got nothing. I got nothing. What the floor with me? to go again. I've got some good cards in this hand though. I don't want to try and force them into like so. I, I think it's just the way it is Mika. I want to try and force now I've got this card which is really good. And this one I want to kind of try to force the computer to play a card here and here in the hope that it will be less than a 9 and a 6 there so I can win the double. The same with like this card. I kind of want to try and force here and here so I can place it here and win both the cards again. So let's try and bait the computer out. Starting off with this. Then I can play this to win two cards. I 
Yeah, I should win this now. I should win this. Because I take two cards again. Wipe the floor with you. Easy! I say easy, but yeah, still, the, tell you what, there's, there's quite a bit of strategy with this one. Alright, time for a hard game. He gets to go first. Alright, let's risk this one. So can I cause this? Please place it. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. It's the same sort of tactic again here. We baited the computer into putting it there so we can win a double. Um, But it's going to be a tie because I can't take any cards and I doubt he's going to be at 7 or 8, which he doesn't. And because it's a tie, he wins. Oh, I look like I got terrible cards this time. See what we can do. Okay. Please don't go top left, oh you imbecile. Uh actually. again even though it's a tie no it's not a tie um yes and no The difference with this is that the computer seems to add on like an extra point for the person that starts. So, okay, what we got here? We got, um, I want to sort of try and lure him in so I can play bottom left. this plays out for a minute. Now this could be the one. 
Yeah, he'll go there. I can use my super card. So that's a tie. There's a tie game right there. He has five cards and I have five cards. I guess, yeah, I guess it maybe the original game does give you an extra point for tying uh, to start with. There's ten cards in play though. There's ten cards in play, so no, it's just how many cards you have left. But he's got like some super card though. Oh no. Uh, it doesn't matter what I play here, I've only got a four. As long as it doesn't take more than one, I've won. Okay, well, what? Oh no. Of course, because if he takes one card, this, yeah, it's too different, isn't it? here, do I? Oh, put it in the wrong place. Idiot. Idiota. Well then, I ain't winning this one. That is certain. Let's take all my cards. So we're strong in bottom right. I don't know how else to force its hand though. I don't know, I, I, th I think it's purely random Mika if I'm honest. Please play to my right. Please play to my right, I said. Okay. It's not to worry. We can still do stuff. I'll try and win a couple of doubles.
Alright, it's a risk. Ah, oh, he took a double. No! But I'll take a double back. But that'll only be 6 4, won't it? Setting up doubles, I think, is definitely the key to winning. You jerk. Yeah, no, these are uh, the cards that I've collected, so, you know, maybe I need to do a bit more card card collecting. I don't want you to play there. Because you'll take the one, and I won't. I'll take the double there, though. There's a chance. I take two. I think that's it. I think I won. No, I don't take two. I only take one. No! <laughs> I, for some reason, I thought that um, he would. T he was taking like middle, top middle there, the top center one. But all right, we'll have a couple more, and then uh, I think we'll give it up as a bad job. I think we possibly need to uh, find some better cards. He, the, like, the computer doesn't seem to have any, like, what I would class as, like, a mediocre card. All the computer's cards seem like real strong cards. Alright, let's see if we can bait the computer into playing here. In the middle. Be a negatory. Seven's only gonna win as one. Done did messed up. Well, okay. Eight more cards to find. So there's a card hidden in the mines.
Yeah. We don't get to pick the uh, the cards, Mika. They're just like taken from the ones that we have. They're just assigned at random. The original like game in Final Fantasy VIII that that is based on is actually quite complex. There's like loads of different like combos and um, very various rule variations you get to play depending on where you are in the game and where you are sort of like in the world sort of thing so yeah it's very um, very complex indeed the worst. one get to that chest. I'm missing somewhere. time with knock I'm seeing being mentioned in the chat.
There's nothing. Yeah. Absolutely nothing. set that bush on fire. Maybe I can do that now that I've um, just got some fire somewhere else. to the beginning. Yikes. Activate that extra fire a moment ago. I need this fire lit, I think.
How did I miss that one before? Does that open up for me now? It's going to go backwards. I mean, this doesn't look like it's much help. Excuse me. Um, yeah, I don't know how to get around that or do what we need to do. So I just need to change to the other timeline. That tell me that I missed a fire thing beside the bridge. Did I get it now, Mika? And all of that for a chest. We got Keris. All right, that's a pretty powerful card. twice because of my incompetence. Alright, mines. Still need to try and figure out how to get these hidden chests. Activate, reactivate the boss fight, so. No way to. There's no way to push them statues at all.
I mean, yeah, there's a chest right there, look. How do we... How do we get that chest? Yeah, we we got to find some like secret pastures or something in the walls. two chests in here. thing I'm wondering here is in the old Zelda games sometimes if you hit your sword on the walls um, you get like a different sound Check down here, but I wonder if found one of them.
I wonder if there's a couple more of those secret passages. Just there, but I don't know. We need to push something out of the way here. Now, I know that was a little bit whack, Fongo would say. But, there we go. that pressure plate. I was just checking there though for like, see if, I know that's like a, a pit that they have to get the enemy into, but I did just wonder whether or not they were doing something weird where if I fell into the pit I would actually get where I wanted to go to. Alright, so we're only five cards short now. I think I've now got everything in here. That's my own fault for rushing. I should tell a lie, there was still one more, I think, isn't there? Um, yeah. So good, that's why we save. Unbelievable. <laughs> now I've worked out the dungeon secrets. Alright, so there must be... There must be a hidden wall for that other chest, right? Ok, 
can we go out of bounds again, I wonder? No, there isn't another path to take there. Alright, so we're looking for something else. Alright, so I'm thinking there'll be a secret entrance from up the top here somewhere. Well, that was like prime territory to have a little secret entrance. Wow, jerk. something up there fumbly which way right at the top or It might be like a, it might be like the other one though. There might be like a, um, a really long path to it. So if I go up to the top, we can see if there's any extra areas accessible at the top. I guess.
There's like no indication on a lot of these like hidden bits. An invisible floor between the gaps. I did think that, Mika. It's, I'm going to go back and check that actually momentarily. can't normally push these statues but I do just kind of want to check Dude, every time. a bit like dodgy right there but it's like like your animation sort of phases through wherever you do that against the wall the thing. There is no way to interact with that at all. take bomb damage or not. See if there's a hidden passage you've got to come from the top or the left stick some sort of the bottom but if it's coming from this side
Alright, well, we're about to wrap it up to be fair. But, because it's like annoying, I gotta, I gotta look at it. I gotta look it up. Oh, wow. So, you know how earlier I said I was checking to see if there was a pit that would put me in a certain place? All right, I gotta find my way there. That's sneaky. Yeah. I just got to find the right pit. I don't know if it's the... I'll rephrase that. I don't know if it's the pit, actually, or if it's, like, the block next to the pit. And these typhoons are annoying. the clink card we got the clink card so I'm pretty sure we got everything else for that one there's a key there that's why that looked a bit dodgy that platform there there was originally a key there um, but yeah I'm pretty sure we've got all the secrets in there alright so real quickly you know I'm not surprised because in um, Zelda A Link to the Past there are actually um um, there are actually rooms, like, because you have multiple floors, you do actually have to drop through some bottomless pits sometimes to actually get down to a lower floor, or to access secrets on a lower floor. Uh, oh, I came out a different way. So that's this way. The boss fight was this way, wasn't it? That's right. I agree. All right, so now that we got these, um,
Yeah, so he's telling us where like the remaining cards are. I've got four more cards to find. I dare say there's a card in like that house that's locked in the village, but I don't know how to unlock the door or that house. So let's see now if we have... Uh, we'll have a couple more games of cards. See if we can't win. If it will actually give me some... A decent hand, that is. Please don't put one to the left. I, uh, the right. I want. To, I want. To, I want the space on the right. Please, please, please. Play to the left. Play to the left. Yes. Ah, uh, but you're taking two cards. <sighs> and of course, he has a special card. Beaten by the same, beaten by the same card. All right, I'll clink in this hand. Take anything, can I? So, if I play this here, could set up possible. All right, let's hope. If I play this here, he doesn't take top left. Jerk. Yeah, I have better cards, but again, with it being still random though, Mika, it's still a bit, like, weird as to whether or not we get to win or not. I have a hunch though that we probably won't be able to win this unless we have all the cards. Alright, this is a good hand. This is a good hand. Fiddle again, though. The only thing I can hope is that his one, on, yeah. I won. How did I win? I have five. I'm not gonna argue it. You got card champion. You defeated all the decks. If 
Wow, there we go. Yeah, don't question it, we won. All right, guys, well, that's where we're going to leave it for tonight. Thank you very much for joining me. I don't know how many percent... I don't know what the percentage is. It doesn't actually tell me, like, my actual percentage. But I guess... It's 100% once I find eight more stars and four more cards. Um, we'll be doing this off, off camera though now. Um, I only wanted to sort of spend one stream doing this. And um, to be fair, I have... Um, to be fair, I've spent um, probably double the amount of time it took me to actually complete the game um, doing this. So uh, we'll be back on Monday. And Monday night we will actually start our playthrough of Evo Land 2 which is a much longer and much more in-depth game from what I believe. So, uh, yeah, if you're interested, come and stick, uh, come and check us out on a Monday night. If not, have a great weekend, and hopefully I will catch you real soon. And until then, I've been Nock, you've been awesome. Take care, stay safe, and happy gaming.